Hey, what's going on? It's Chris Cass back here one more time on YouTube.com officially and exclusively on YouTube.com. Now, what I would like to do now is I would like to take a step back and just think about some of the things that uh that that I've went over before in the past and because of reasons out of my control. My last channel, which a lot of you know, uh I had a lot of technical difficulties and problems and a whole bunch of videos got erased. I'm not dwelling on it. I'm moving on. I'm thinking about the future. But there's a couple of things that I did there within the last month that I want to revisit. And this is one of the things. Uh, I, I come up with a video idea and I had my homeboy Dan Wenzel, who and I will link him below, uh, come up with by the way he's on Twitter and you can follow him every day even Sunday at Dan Wenzel on Twitter .com. just remember now now that I did my shout out to Dan what's going on player uh, I wanted to do I wanted to redo the video that we come up with and I say we come up with because I had the idea to come up with uh, today who has some of the best entrance musics in wrestling, not just TNA, not just WWE, but in both. Uh, and I'm sure ROAs, they have a lot of, of good stuff going on. Since I don't pay attention, not that I don't pay attention, but I don't get to watch ROAs because I don't have access uh, and because I just don't want to go find it online because I'm lazy, I decided let's just do, let's just redo this, this video. Uh, I was going to just re update it, I mean, just re upload it, same video. But then I thought, no, nah, I might as well just redo it because it gives me more joy. And plus, uh, the video was kind of dark. Uh, there wasn't enough light on set in my bedroom for whatever. I taped it right here with the camera facing the same wall, the same condemned poster that is up right now it was up in that video. So, anyway. Uh, but now I do have the lovely uh, Hooters bag hanging up right here, which which I got from Hooters. Uh, more on that one day. Uh, but now the best entrance, and I had Dan send me a list, send me a list of what of who he thought was some of the best entrance music, and the some bitch stole some of my ideas that I wanted to talk about, that I wanted to bring up for me. But anyway, uh, I'll still get to talk about them because Dan's not here, and of course uh, he doesn't want to be on camera. Obviously, no, that's because he's. 300, 400 miles away, probably more than that, and can't. So, I get to bring you all of the greatness that is these uh, these entrance musics. Now, Dan's picks, his uh, his list looks something like this. Sam Paul, Kill Switch Engage, This Fire Still Burns, or Fire Still Burns. Excellent song. Sam Paul, Many, many times he's just owned this song when he comes out and just owns it. Now it's more, you know, it's for the Nexus. The Nexus uses it a lot. But you got to still give it up because Punk, I still feel like he kind of owns it, just not as much as he used to. Uh, Christian, Just Close Your Eyes, by one of my favorite bands who redid the song. The song was originally recorded uh, by a band called Waterproof Blonde. Try saying that three times fast because you know you will screw it up. But upon Christian's return after going to TNA and he came back to WWE, he wanted to use the same song, which is an awesome song, but updated. And what he did was he had Story of the Year. One, like I said, one of my favorite bands today, redo the song, and there it is. Randy Orton, Voices. There's probably not another guy whose theme song fits them so well than Randy Orton. Love it. I love the music. Uh, the Miz, I mean, I came to play. I came to play. There's a price to pay. There's, you got a price to pay. Time for you to get down on your knees. I came to play. Uh, Chris Jericho, uh, look, I just watched the Chris Jericho DVD. Now, when Chris Jericho first debuted in the WWE in 1999, it was awesome, okay? And I got goosebumps watching his debut. Because it was amazing. The music fit perfect then. It's the same song. It's been done for 
you know, 12 years. I kind of feel, oh, well, almost 12 years. I kind of feel like he needs a new song. I don't understand why he doesn't just record a song with Fozzie. And I hope he does that before he comes back. That would be at least something new. Something new to fit his new persona because his his persona changed, but the music didn't. And I felt like, and it changed a little bit, but it didn't change like it needed to. So, maybe it will. Edge. Who doesn't love Mel Langus? That Alter Bridge song is just an amazing song. I absolutely love it. Uh, and then, of course, Rob Van Dam. Of course, everybody does the things, and I've said many times, I'm doing the things! Oh my god, I can't believe I'm marking out, but, you know. Alright, now, on for my picks. And I have a few more listed. First off, I want to just hit honorable mentions uh, by my part. Uh, and by the way, the, the Chris Jericho was an honorable mention for Dan just because he loves Chris Jericho so much. He, he wanted to put him on the list. And, you know, i got to give it to him because Jericho is awesome. Now, now that I've kissed Jericho's ass enough, uh, my honorable mentions, Beer Money, Mr. Anderson, uh, Robbie E. and Cookie, the, the whole, uh, the Shore gimmick, which I, I think the music fits their gimmick extremely well. Probably one of the top three as far as fitting well in with uh, TNA wrestlers. And uh, Lake Cool. I think it's awesome. Oh, uh, and Melina. Now, as far as my main list, uh, Zack Ryder. Come on. Come on now, you know when you hear, hold on. <coughs> oh, radio, tell me everything you know. Okay, I just lost five subscribers for doing that. But anyway, it was fun. It was funny, so I did it. Uh, Dolph Ziggler, Mr. I Am Perfection. Uh, God, big things coming from Dolph Ziggler. Uh, of course, Jeff Hardy has got a great, a great song. Uh, like I said, Bear Money. Natalia, come on. That little, that guitar riff at the first of the song, she stole that from Brett, but it was great. And I love it. Uh, Mickey James, the hardcore country, fits her because of the country career. I don't like that she has a country career, but I will say, I still love Mickey James, and Mickey, you can still bear my offspring. I will let you. No charge. No charge at all. I'll let you bear my offspring. Because, let's just face it. As smart as I am, and as talented as you are, we would have some freaking amazing children. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You can sing. You can wrestle. I can wrestle a little bit. You know, for those of you who know, I used to. Uh, but I'm not, I'm not on that level. Never have been. But I am just the smartest man in the business. That's why I am the wrestling guru. Remember that. Uh, uh, did I say Jeff Hardy? I said Jeff Hardy. And the last guy on my list, of course, that I didn't mention in the first one, and I got to give a shout out to Chris Halls for 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 reminding me of this. That I didn't I didn't uh, I didn't put him out there. Drew McIntyre. Love it. Love it. To me, the best music in the business. I absolutely love it. Now, now that I, Chaos, has spoken once again, it's time for you to speak. Tell me what you think. If there's someone I left off the list, again, tell me. I'll shout you out in the video. Remember, until next time, Chaos has spoken.